Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jason and this is Quick Shifts. Today we're back with you again and we got another package from Bullet Point Mounting Solutions. If you guys have been watching the channel, you see me do reviews on their other mounting solutions for the Jeep and I'm a big fan. They've done a great job for me. They keep the phone secure. They hold it in place. You have the adjustability to move the phone around. So I wanted to go ahead and try something new here. So we'll pull this out and uh, show you guys this. They always have really nice packaging. We'll pull this out and what we got today is the uh, new mount for the phone. You always get stickers and uh, some nomenclature. And now they supply a QR code for how to use the item that you bought and some uh, magnetic rings. But what we're here to talk about is the new mount, the charging mount for MagSafe phones. And I wanted to give this a try. I've been uh, cautious about trying it because the MagSafe connections in the past haven't been the greatest that come with these phones, but got the new Apple iPhone 15 Pro Max and wanted to see if this will hold up and as good as the other products that we've had. And if you guys hear that, it's a nice good connection to the phone and it seems really sturdy. So I'm excited to give this a try. It really grabs onto the back of the phone. I do have a MagSafe or MagSafe case on the phone between the phone itself, this case and the new connector. And uh, we're gonna go ahead and install this in the Jeep and see how well it keeps our phone in place. Additionally, it's also come with uh, the power cord to plug it in. So this again has the 20 millimeter ball like all the bullet point mounting solutions come with. So it should be an easy swap for the other unit that I installed previously and I'll have a link up here for you guys on that one. Um, we'll go ahead and take this out to the Jeep. We'll install it and then we'll give it some time to see how we like it and we'll follow back up and let you guys know and you'll catch that on the back end of the video here. Man, I'm excited about this. It really seems to jump on there nicely. But if you want a more secure connection, they actually supply you with these metallic rings that are supposed to grip even better. And those do seem like they're pretty solid on there. So uh, let's go ahead and install this on the Jeep. So here we are back in the Jeep. And as you guys can see, here is my existing bullet point mounting solutions uh, mount for my 4xe and uh, what we're going to do now is we're going to go ahead and loosen this connection and pull this uh, mounting bracket off and then go ahead and install this one and then we'll plug it in here and then plug it into the bottom here and give this a go. So first off let's go ahead and loosen this to the point where we can pull this out. And I'll keep this in case I want to go back to it or use it in another vehicle. Again, you can see bullet point mounting solutions on there. Pull that off and pop this in. And like all instructions, reverse assembly. Tighten this back up. See how far I can get doing this one-handed. All right, got it on there. Position it where I want it. And then snug that up. And there we go. So now that's snugged on there. Then we'll grab the cord here. We'll plug this in. Plug this in the bottom and of course you can mount these cords however you want. I've seen where some other people have gone and mounted these so they go in through here so you don't have the cable dangling down here. But for myself I'll just uh, put a tie on this cable to make it nice and neat and that's about it. <coughs> Excuse me. So then now that we've got this installed 
plugged in. Let's go ahead and put the phone on there and make sure that it's charging. And we can see 83%, it is doing the charge like we want it to do. So this is working. It seems to be mounted on there nicely. So even with this mount on here one way, how we have it, you see that uh, one of the things you run into is this is close with this bump on the case here, but it does fit on there and it sticks in place nicely. You can also pivot this around the mount and you can see it's still charging here. So you don't lose that when you're putting that on there. It still stays connected. You gotta see it pop up there. So that's kind of nice to have. I've, I do like that. You don't have to swivel it around for wanting to have your phone in different directions. It'll allow you to do that with the phone staying on here. And it is a nice tight grip on there. You really gotta give it a little tug to get it off. So we'll see if it stays put or if my phone bounces on and off. Well guys, it's been a couple of weeks now and I've been living with this mount. And I gotta say, I love this mount and I highly recommend it. It's not as grippy as the previous version of it that we had, but it's grippy enough that the phone never falls off. In fact, right now I'm making this video with the phone on that mount. And Bullet Point Mounting Solutions has done a great job. They've knocked it out of the park. I'm doing this video, my phone is mounted very securely, and it is actually charging at the same time. This is what you want from a mount, and it's simple. I don't have to worry about extra hands or putting it in a grip. I can just take it out and use it and go on my way. So you guys need to check out these bullet point mounting solutions. Highly recommend them still. The charging solution that you guys just watched me install, highly recommend it. Pick one of these up. I bet this would work in multiple vehicles, not just the Jeep 4xe by any means or any Jeep, any Jeep Wrangler. So check those guys out, hit the link down below, and uh, hit the like button, subscribe, share this with your friends who are also looking for them out. Thanks for checking in, guys.